We are back. What's up guys? How's it going? Mark Freeman 408. So we're doing another sled wrap. We got Mason here. What's up? Hello. How are you? Good, good. So you got this freshie. Freshie, new to me. New to you? Well, pretty much brand new. What year is it? 2020 and a half. Only 1500K. It's got the beautiful digital dash. I've never even seen these dashes. Yeah. yeah you can run everything through there, eh? Music. And there's a little control on the side. Uh, yeah, sweet. So the wrap's under here. Yeah, and, trying to get flat. And the wrap is also called the mace <laughs> to match with you. So we're just flattening out the wrap right now. Using everything I could to... <laughs> Flatten her out, yeah. <laughs> so I haven't done a trail sled in a while. I've, do I've done all my race sleds, but they're pretty much the same. So I guess we'll set up the time lapse and uh, get this thing going. Here we go. <laughs> I was like, don't touch me. I'm sleepy. Anyway, she's coming together. So I feel like I've done this a few times before. We're, we're getting her sorted. That gold flake looks good. The old deviant ink wrap. Yeah, I got the light. Flash. There we go. Woo. So I got everything on the sides done. And then now we're going to do the panels soon. There's lots of little stuff. Unfortunately, we'll have to cut around this. Uh, my red sled doesn't have this, obviously, or this, so. But yeah, it shouldn't be too bad. We'll just cut around it. And then we're going to figure out the back. Do that one. And yeah, a couple more hours, have some lunch soon, and get the Friday party started. <laughs> right, Nala? <laughs> Done. What was that about five hours? Five and a half hours later. Still five and a half hours. Give or uh, give or take with some pizza at lunch. A few small breaks. That was awesome. Thank God for this lift too. It uh, got her lifted up. But yes, this gold flake in the sun. It's kind of hard to tell on camera, but she looks awesome. And it went on super easy too. There's a uh, just a couple that we had to adjust, but nothing too crazy. And uh, yeah, the tunnel and the uh, battery cover. Obviously, I don't have that on my sled, so, but, uh, or the gas tank, so I didn't have any of this, so we figured that all out. But, and uh, yes, the tunnel ones definitely fit a lot better than on my sled. I just picked a random one because I don't know if they have the exact, but uh, yeah, she looks mean. Job Very well happy. done. You're going to have fun Very this happy. weekend riding, eh? Even the top. Go like, break it in, scratch it up. Yeah, just run her through some trees. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, maybe maybe we'll finish this video with uh, take my sled for a rip. Make sure you go check out Deviant Inc. Link below. And uh, yeah, wrap your sled. Keep her protected. All right. Well, we got to end this video with a little bit of sledding. We I uh, got the sled wrapped. It was perfect. But we're gonna leave it in the garage all night. Keep her warm and keep the heat gun on if any little quarters peel off so let's go rip this thing we got Laura in here so 
somewhere. <laughs> You're on camera! Oh boy, we found the truck. <laughs> Super sketchy. I know I tried there, tried everything. I even went to the other ditch after, and that was so sketchy. So basically, we had a bunch of snow and then two days of rain. So there's about three inches of ice everywhere. The driveway is completely ice. Like everywhere you go, no one can even tear up the ice. So we tried. I tried, you know, the front would go up, and then I would just hit ice and start dancing anywhere, everywhere. And then, of course, all the ruts from the side by side the other day. So Anyways, I just wanted to wrap up the video with, you know, some actual snowmobiling, but uh, I guess that's what you get. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. We're definitely going to get out this weekend on the side-by-side -side and uh, test out those ice tires some more, hopefully on some bigger ice, not just the, the horse ring over there. So thank you guys for watching. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Get yourself some crabbing gloves, and uh, we'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.